and welcome to this uh, super short update on my DIY remote controller surface. As you can see, I have uh, implemented my uh, custom board, meaning that I have uh, uh, set the wall surface on the new custom board. Well, operatively, this means that I have transposed, that I have migrated uh, from the uh, Nucleo board uh, implementation. Nucleo board is the one that I use for the prototypation to my custom board. Everything is working fine, as you can see. And however, as you might guess, uh, there is a, a problem. The problem is that the set of the wiring on the custom board is a real mess. Why this? But simply because uh, I have uh, took the implementation, the mapping of the GPIO uh, that there is inside the Nucleo board, and I have uh, connected straight the, way, the very same way I did it on the, on the board to my custom board, where in my custom board, I have organized the GPIO uh, in a, a sequential, simple way, following the numbering of the microcontroller. So line one, two, three, four, as it is on the microcontroller. And that's the result. This is because the organization of the GPIO uh, uh, mapping inside the uh, Nucleo board, it's quite fancy. Uh, 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 to the best of my uh, understanding, this is the result of the match, the fit of uh, uh, the uh, ST uh, headers together with the Arduino headers uh, and finally together with the uh, connectivity of the microcontrollers itself. Uh, uh, if you transpose this into a sequential uh, uh, numbering, the one of my custom board, this is the result. So clearly I cannot uh, um, uh, work like this because it's too messy and it's substantially unreadable and un uh, uh, unmanageable. So uh, this means that uh, I will have to rearrange it according to the setup of my custom board, which is something that I didn't forecast to do and I'm not very happy to do because it will take some time. And however, I think it will be a good investment because uh, 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 even setting up the PCB uh, when I will be designing it uh, uh, will make it would be a much more easy and effective experience. In fact, I think that setting up a PCB with this wiring uh, will most likely require uh, more than two layers, uh, so uh, a complexity which is typically uh, better to avoid, if it's possible to avoid. Uh, uh, and so, I mean, uh, I will. I, I decide that I will do it. As soon as I will have uh, uh, rearranged the uh, GPIO setting, uh, I will post the new a new video. Probably I will take uh, the UART, so the channel and the display as they are, but I will rearrange all the buttons, which, you know, unfortunately is most of the, of the work. So uh, that's it. Uh, thank you very much for listening and see you.